And because I'm a wheelchair user, this is actually a prime spot. I'm very active and, and I do dance and sports. Um, I'm a hand cyclist. Um, I do rock climbing. Um, I'm a fantastic swimmer. I, the last time I swam, I swam a mile and a half in an hour and a half. So yeah, I can say I'm a fantastic <laughs> swimmer. I try to eat healthy and um, I have tons of food allergies. So just, just my food is actually work because <laughs> um, I'm allergic to gluten, dairy, soy, peanut, mango, and banana. And half of those are anaphylactic. What I do as an advocate is um, I try to encourage other disabled people to do sports. And um, I have been very successful at getting people involved in, for, for example, rock climbing. Um, I met a guy that lives here at Oak Park and he had never been rock climbing and I told him that it's very amputee friendly and that he should try it and he does and that was a few years ago and um, now he's at a competitive level in rock climbing. The doctors that really take care of me well and, the, and it's not just doctors but nurses and nurse practitioners and they have to stop, sit down, or at least be eye level and talk to me. I mean, I need information and I just need somebody to explain what is going on. And some people, they are so busy informing me, but they don't ask me, do I, do, do you understand? Um, they, and it's like, I don't know what the heck is going on. You gotta tell me. And it's really scary. And I, I like when a person relaxes and stops instead of just like barreling through. Each person has different needs. And um, we are individuals. Even people who have the same disability, um, their needs are different than my needs. And it's not fair to treat us all as like one person, which I think some people might want to do. But, okay, I have auditory processing disorder. Sometimes I use sign language. I'm semi-literate in ASL. And other people, they've never done sign language. It always helps me. Um, but other people want to put captions on the bottom of the screen. But, I mean, you should have one and not the other. Each person, even though we have the same disability, we do it, we take care of our needs differently. And if, you, if they need the captions, make sure that captions are there. And um, if, or for me, when I'm in a large meeting, I need the interpreter. I know it's not the same as when you're talking to patients, but each person, they have, it's different. And that was the point. I, I, I had been interviewed by the East Loop newspaper. Who knew there was an East Loop newspaper? <laughs> And um, they did a wonderful um, picture of me and my muscles in my, <laughs> this part of my arm was like very big. The gun show. Yeah, I got the only type of guns you should have. Because <laughs> I'm very against guns. Yeah. But these guns. Yeah, those guns are good. These guns are good. <laughs>